The owners of an ATV shop are relieved that nothing was stolen after security cameras caught someone trying to break in. WTVA's Nicole Dantzler spoke with the owners. She joins us live to share what they saw on their cameras. Emily, West Point Police shared video of a person attempting to break in to the Adventure ATV shop here. Now, the owners say that the person was unsuccessful and eventually left, but they are glad that the alarm scared the person away because they went through something similar just last year. Uh, it's just like somebody breaking into your house, really. Um, um, to think that somebody can go in and take what they want. The security footage shows a man with a mask attempting to break into the Adventure ATV shop's fence with bolt cutters. Co-owner Jack Jamison says the man entered through the back where the two green sheds are, stopped by this white door, and broke into the fence here. He then noticed the security cameras when the alarm went off and left. The alarm company alerted Jack Jamison around 2 a.m. on Saturday to tell him police are on the scene to respond to an attempted break-in. Pretty much violates you. Uh, you know, they're trying to take something from you that's uh, yours and your employees and your families, and it's kind of a hurt your heart when people just do that. But this isn't the first time someone has broken into the shop. Somebody broke in. They stole two machines and a trailer. Uh, that still has not been solved or we haven't figured out what's going on with it. Jack Jamison says break-ins have happened there almost every year, but since then they've gotten new cameras and he's confident that it's deterring burglary. But it's doing its job very well and uh, all the motions in the camera and everything we have now, um, it's, uh, it's definitely helps and it's going to catch him eventually. So. The owner, Sonny Jamison, says they have a good lead as to who may be responsible for this, and they also think that the break-in from last year, the burglary, could be connected to what happened. Live in West Point, Nicole Dantzler, WTVA, 9 News.